know, for two teams that like to play as many as seven offensive linemen, the line of scrimmage at one time. I used to seeing five wide. Morgan hit as he threw it, and it's picked off. Illinois forces the game's first turnover, Tariq Barnes. Single high safety, man to man underneath, and there was a sniffer in the middle of the field, which simply means kind of spying on Tanner Morgan. The pressure led to this tipped ball, the pressure up the middle, and Carney around the end. Outstanding field position plus territory. Brandon Peters on the field, gets rid of it. Carlos Sandy reels in the pass at the 40, a nine yard pickup. And rumor has it, this week in practice, he was lights out also. So on second and short, quarterback sneak under center. Peters picks up the first. They've got plenty of weapons at the line of scrimmage, just like Minnesota. Ask Penn State about it. Chase Brown with a burst and a first down. Chase Brown, far side rumble stopped by Gibbons. That's an 11 yard pickup. He's put up enormous numbers, as you would expect a Brett Bielema running back to do. And they've got a couple in the backfield. Brown again to the edge and ushered out short of the 20 yard line. Good early fit against Minnesota defensively. Brown on its feet on third down. Brown probes right at the line to gain. And I think he got there. First down. And don't give up explosive plays. How about old school I formation? Play action. Peters has a man wide open. Illinois on the move towards the pylon. And Luke Ford dives for it. Well, first look at the barge formation. You got linemen everywhere. Isaiah Williams to the edge with a cut and the touchdown. Tip pass turnover. And it's not, you don't get blue ribbons for turnovers or takeaways. You get blue ribbons for getting into the end zone after one. And every since then has been absolutely consistently good on the field from that point on. Pocket collapses. Morgan lost the handle for a moment and is going to be sacked back inside the 20 yard line. Roderick Perry, Owen Carney. Illinois showing pressure. Now we'll back out of it. And a conservative call is Bucky Irving. That's a lot on the line of scrimmage. Brown the running back. Peters back in at quarterback. A nice cut and Brown will plow over one defender. Vertically to the second level. Not let it spread horizontally. Peters will keep it on second and five. And Illinois on the move again. Pull it and keep it off of that mid zone run. Barge back in play. Outside zone. They'll stretch it out. And there goes Brown. Another big gainer for Illinois. All the way to midfield. He's getting a good look at it early. Williams back in as the quarterback and the handoff straight ahead into plus territory. Williams remains the quarterback. And straight ahead. On second down and five. That should be enough to move the chains as we check in again with Lori. But trust me, it's going to be power football and zone run because that's who Brett Bielema is. Peters under center. Brown left side and they found something across the way. Sent out at the 35. Six straight runs to start this possession for the Fighting Illini. Brown another nifty cut and another first down. But the outcome does not count in the league standings. Isaiah Williams back in at quarterback. And a handoff. To Josh McCray. So his first touch. Peters wants to throw it and he will. Pass is caught. That'll move the sticks. And the tight end, Daniel Barker, reels it in for a first down. For our second quarter, critical matchup in the Big Ten West. Play action for Peters. In zone, wide open for the touchdown. Tip Ryman reaches pay dirt. First touchdown of the season and of the redshirt freshman's career. The defense sees this massive formation, and they think, obviously, we got to get our heads in the run fit, and then it's... A naked boot by Brandon Peter. There's a braid back there on the offset patch of hair on the left side of the head. A braided rat tail, I think. Some, something along those lines. It's a bit unusual as Cole Kramer's bottled up. Sisler, a fast start for Illinois on the road. A 14-0 lead. It's number 20, Minnesota. Brown, a power finish and a five-yard gain. The stop by Boye. Yeah, big and bigger for sure. 
Or the Gophers trail it by two scores. Morgan, the quarterback, Irving, the handoff. No real estate available. Drop for a loss by Jamal Woods, and he'll lose two. Brown, a gap, stop short. Jack Gibbons again. Gone from Irving back to Thomas. In pocket again for Morgan, and now they'll try to scramble out. Got happy feet brought down behind the line of scrimmage. Timeout to work with, approaching a minute to go. Play action. Morgan, flush, brought down at the 20. Lose about half a yard. Roderick Perry got there in time. 16 touches for Brown in the first half. Play action to start the second. Rolling out to the right, and a quick pass. Caught ahead at the 29. Wally in coverage, a four-yard gain for Isaiah Williams. First and second down a little bit. I formation. Brown gets it right side. And he'll have another Illinois first down. He's headed towards the century mark, a seven-yard gain there. And they're trying to move you one direction or the other. That's what the run game is on both sides of the field. Illinois. 83% of their plays have been runs today. This one through the air, but Brown has it on the middle screen. Morgan has it, the pump fake, and he's going to be sacked all the way back at the 32-yard line. That one just felt uncomfortable. Brown in the backfield. Peters has it. Deep ball, Casey Washington. And he reels it in in plus territory. Tony Peterson tell us this week, Casey Washington, our best 50-50 ball guy. The contested catch, we feel very confident he can make those. Chase Brown lays the lumber out of bounds. At home, you go back to Bowling Green, and Golden Gopher fans, it's the last team that they want to hear about, considering what happened. Minnesota's last loss of the season after four straight wins. Four four straight wins, and that's going to be another Tackle behind the line. Johnny Newton, Calvin Avery, pick your poison. Continues to drive and eventually get in the end zone. There's plenty of time left. Plus three timeouts to work with. Jackson with the previous catch. Loss of yards here. Isaiah Gay. The score tells the story this afternoon. Minneapolis. Points have been at a premium. And what was that you said about the wedge? Down inside the two-yard line, a punt of 41 yards. Had that interception on the first possession of the game for the Golden Gophers. Backside pressure, down he goes, Isaiah Gay. Who else? Morgan, deep toss, intercepted. Picked off by Kirby Joseph, and that'll do it. Illinois on the road in the Big Ten West finds a way. And Minnesota was going right back to that big play they've already had on this drive. Dalen Wright was coming in on the dig route. This one was thrown too high.